YouTube. My name is Derek, or um, well, I go by Derek. My channel name and YouTube name is Dino Seven Boy, and I am here with a little introduction video and some tips on, you know, what you should stay away from as a commentator and what you can work on. You know, basically. Oh, sorry. Rule number one: don't have a lot of background noise. Sorry about that, but uh, yeah, basically, uh, the video is um, tips on how to improve your commentary so I'm gonna start off with me um, I like to play League of Legends that's what I was in the back of the uh, my name is Derek I am 18 years old I attend college I'm not really sure what college I'm going to in the fall I went to him went to community college last semester and I'm going to a university this semester, well, fall, next small, next small, next fall, not sure which university I'm going to, I'm pretty sure it's Spring Arbor, I live in Michigan, um, up north, so, you know, really wish I lived in, like, California or something, have some interesting stories to tell you about Michigan, but I don't know, Michigan sucks, but, um, I, uh, am a director and a staff member on Monostar TV, I, run I help run Monostar Let Supernova and uh, basically what I do for Supernova is I upload videos you know get people to go ahead to um, put the videos up on Supernova um, I recruit people for the main channel pretty much you know things like that I've been with Monostar since the very beginning because I was on the other like we had a few attempts on creating network before uh, Monostar so I was on those but um I feel like we really got it on Monastar and um and hopefully we can continue to grow and get more commentators to join. I've been telling people to join now because when we get big <laughs> it's gonna be harder to get in. So if you have any friends that you know are good commentators and have you know, good um video quality right now then um just let us know and we'll um check them out and see if what we can do about them joining. Monastar, wow, laggy. But, um, yeah, so the main thing about League of Legends is fairly laggy sometimes in the servers. But, um, mainly why I was gonna make this video was so I could have some content on the channel. And what I wanted to do was give some tips to some commentators out there. And I know, by, um, I am no professional commentator by any means. And I know that. And anybody who watches my videos knows that I mess up a lot. I've messed up quite a few times at the beginning of this video, but yeah, I know professional, but as a viewer of, you know, um, I actually subscribe to a lot of commentators' um, channels, like, so if you have a channel and you want me to check it out, I will, I will gladly check it out, you know, I have no problem with sub to my channel. I don't know why a lot of people are stingy about that, like, they, they won't sub to people's channels. It's not that big of a deal, like, wow, the videos are going to be on your sub box. You don't have to watch them, you know, like, um... So yeah, um, one of the tips that I was going to give out was have a clear microphone and speak clearly. Because if you don't speak clearly and you have a messed up microphone, first of all, the messed up microphone is going to mess you up anyway. But if you don't speak clearly, people aren't going to want to um, watch your videos because they don't know what you're saying, you know? Um, a lot of people have like really like fuzzled microphones and you know... I know my microphone isn't the best. I have like a $20 mic I'm using right now, but I plan on getting a better one as I progress as a commentator. But um, I try to speak up, and I try to speak with a lot of enthusiasm. A lot of people who do commentary usually speak like they're bored, like, oh, well, we're going to play some League of Legends. I hate to play one ahead to me. Like, nobody's gonna wa wanna watch your video if you do sound bored. Then they'll be bored. You know, you wanna keep your you wanna sound like you're having fun, so your viewers will have fun watching you, you know? You don't really see a lot of um you know, bigger commentators making videos of them sounding bored while they're playing the game. And that could be the reason like you could not like the game you're recording. Like if, if even if it's a really popular game, like I suggest you never record a game that you wouldn't really play getting the game right now. He was on here at first, but that's what he's here now. But yeah, um, I said just never record a game that you don't want to play, you know, because if you're bored playing the game, then your commentary will suffer for it. For, so always record a game that you have fun playing, you know. Um, along with enthusiasm and the microphone, and, you know, uh, clearness of your voice. Also, make sure you don't stutter over your words a lot, like I've been tending to doing in this video. I've been, you know, tripping over our words and uh, uh, saying uh, a lot. Make sure you don't do that. 
just because you want to get your point out and you want to do it efficiently and you don't want to beat around the bush a lot. Like if you have something to say or you have a point in the video, make sure you get to it. You don't want to stall because people can turn up the video because they won't know like what it's about. Like, oh, well, this guy's taking too long. Make sure you get to the point. Don't rush though. There's a there's a timing to commentary. Don't just say, hey, this is my video already, so what I'm gonna do is, you know, you wanna take your time. If if it helps, you know, take some breaths before you do the commentary. You know, it's all about it's all about experience. Basically, the longer you do commentary, I feel like the better you get. The more enthused you get, you know, the better your content gets. Um, just make sure you enjoy doing it. That's like the main thing. You never want to do a commentary of a game. Like even if even the game is you're getting a lot of views on the game. Like if you do Modern Warfare commentary and you don't really like Modern Warfare, I suggest you don't like record Modern Warfare because you're gonna suffer. Like because they're gonna tell they can tell like oh this guy's like it doesn't really sound like he's having fun, you know. And like I said earlier, this is not me trying to tell you what to do as a commentator. This is just me as a viewer. Like, as a viewer who watches a lot of commentary commentaries, uh, I see a lot of mistakes that people make. Wow, this guy will not leave my lane anymore. Yeah. Um, yeah, I see a lot of mistakes that people will make. And, um... Uh, I'm going to have to juke these guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm gonna have to juke these guys. He's coming. He's coming. Lee Sin's coming from the top. Oh, they're dumb. I juke them. Oh, okay. Well, that's fun. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, geez, I completely lost what I was doing. Um, well, I'm just gonna go to the next point because this is live commentary, and I don't wanna. I'm gonna take my own advice and not be around. But wow, they kill a lot of people up there. Oh, he's gonna get a double kill. Wait a minute, my lane. Run away, run away. I feel bad. Um, yeah, but my next tip was going to be if you have a joke or some sort, you know, a lot of commentators have like these set jokes they do. Like, not even jokes, like catchphrases and stuff. Well, for this instance, a joke. If you have a joke that you say during a lot of your commentaries, make sure you don't wear it out. I, I watch a lot of videos when people have jokes like they say things that aren't in it like air to the knee jokes and stuff and if you constantly say it it'll get annoying it will uh, trust me I'm, uh you don't you can't believe how tired i am of air to the knee jokes i hear them all the time well i used to hear them all the time most time it's like are you trying to troll or are you like really think that's funny because it's like, ah. come on come here come here come here i think i got him Okay, there you go. Yeah, but um, if you think it's funny, then by all means, you know, like, that's your sense of humor. But you don't want to annoy the your viewers with saying the same crap over and over again. Trust me, it gets annoying. It really does. And I've never been a... If you're going to have a thing that you call, like, your subs, like, I know, like, I'm trying to think of a, some popular commentators like PewDiePie... I, Personally, I'm, I, I have nothing against people. I just don't find them funny. Like, I, the only commentators I really watch are like Uber Hacks or Nova, and like, I, uh, I watch a lot of the features, um, Seamus, I guess. And, um, that's I don't really watch too many. I really enjoy watching smaller commentators because I feel like their content actually. It's up there with a lot of the quote-unquote professional commentators. But if you have something that you call your subs, you know, like bros or homies or something, that's by all means that's fine. But make sure you keep like your content fresh. Don't don't keep saying the same stuff over again because it gets annoying. Um, as far as tips goes, that it probably it for right now. Um, right, I'm just trying to show off some of my pro skills at. Um, League of Legends right now and um yeah so if you want to check out my channel please do feel free to check out my channel um I if you have a channel that you want me to check out uh, by all means message me I have no problem with checking out people's channels and subbing to them even if I don't personally like your content I will try my best to help you and I'm and I'm not picky with commentators like it's just some things that I find annoying like I don't know but um yeah, if you're looking forward to doing a dual comp with me, please tell me, because I haven't done a dual com since I've started YouTube. I've been doing YouTube for about a year now, so thanks everybody for watching. If you're not subscribed to Monostar, please subscribe to Monostar. If you're not subscribed to Supernova, Eclipse, or Galaxy, please subscribe to those, because they will be having probably content coming up very soon. 
and you don't want to miss out because we are growing like it may not be obvious to most of you pretty obvious to me and a lot of people who are in Monstar we're growing so if you want to be a part of it I suggest you do it quick so thank you everybody for watching my video um, if you want to see more League of Legends on the channel please let me know I'm playing Victor because you don't really see a lot of victors going on and my build is pretty uh, you know <laughs> I just like the way they buffed the um, Chalice of Harmony so now I can have infinite mana and it'll scale good into late game because this guy has blue buff and I don't and we're losing this is just blind pick I'll never play ranked like with Victor you have to be like bro like well you don't have to but a lot of people stick to cheap tactics on ranked so anyways before I go you know I'm rambling on about nonsense League of Legends stuff yeah, if you want to see more League of Legends, let us know. I feel like it's pretty unique content for our channel. Uh, that is it. My name is DNM7Boy, and I will see you guys later.